For this problem, we're going to sketch the graph of the ellipse given by 9x squared plus 16y squared equals 576. Here we have the standard equation of an ellipse. The first thing we need to do is to get our equation into standard form. The first step is to get the right hand side equal to 1. So we're going to divide both sides by 576. After reducing the fractions, we have x squared over 64 plus y squared over 36 equals 1. The last step is to rewrite both of the denominators. So we have x squared over 8 squared plus y squared over 6 squared equals 1. Now that our equation is in standard form, we know that a is equal to 8 and will be horizontal since it is underneath the x, b is equal to 6 and will be vertical since it is underneath the y, and the center is at 0, 0. Now we will plot the relevant points. The center is at 0, 0, and the major axis points will be 8 to the left and 8 to the right of the center. So the first point is at negative 8, 0, and the second point is at 8, 0. The minor axis points will be 6 above and 6 below the center. So the first point is at 0, 6, and the second point is at 0, negative 6. Now we will connect the points to get an ellipse that looks like this. In addition, we can also find the foci. We can do this by using the equation c squared equals a squared minus b squared, where c represents the distance from the center on the major axis. So for this problem, we have 8 squared minus 6 squared, which is equal to 28. So c is equal to the square root of 28, which is roughly about 5.29. So the two focus points will be at negative 5.290 and 5.290. Finally, we will plot the two focus points, and this completes the problem.